Oh, let's snoop around some. Oh, the glove box, huh? Open that. Oh, spilling out with chilling pipes. Oh, uh, partially burnt candles. Oh, there are lots of crumbled maps of uh, West Pakistan. Uh, yeah, Bangladesh hadn't got born yet. Afghanistan. Need no map there. I mean, they have three whole towns in the country Kabul, Kandahar, Harat. Don't get confused. Iran, Turkey. Bulgaria? Get through there. Huh? Yugoslavia? Anybody remember Yugoslavia, Tito, and all that? Um, Europe. Let's just glob one deal on Europe and call it a day. Oh, oh awesome. The vibes. Huh? Awesome. Uh, acid adventures. Yeah, all. Look at that. Cotton Indian bedspread with a huge mogul peacock fanning itself out. All feathers out. Bling, bling. Crash down on that, huh? Yeah. Uh, well, yeah, Silk, huh? He's slick. You know, he's got the van keys. I mean, just picked up Fox a few days ago at the Bullfrog, listening to uh, Pasha Reed huh, from his book, Hippie History of Hashish. Yeah. So he's, he's like seductively, like dangling in the keys, jingy, jingy. And she says, Well, look, um, Let's check out the rock and roll. Durability of the van. So they crawl inside. Uh, they close the curtain. That toothless Eskimo playing, come on, baby, light my fire. Just like, no, too early. Shut the curtain on him. And uh, smoke a, 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 a little, little travel hookah. I mean, they've been working the coffee houses. You got the bullfrog. Then they went over to the the grasshopper near the train station. They got you know, three grams of good hashish, too. Expensive, but, yeah. Well, okay, uh, off come the clothes. And Foxy, uh, she's too young to have a driver's license, uh, raises one naked thigh up. She's got one of those uh, harem ankle bracelets, and she jingy jingy uh -huh, in in Silk's face. And he, well, there is a trail of perspiration starting from her ankle, headed toward her knee. He licks that trail uh, right down to uh, her uh, little Netherlands. With the first uh, fluff of uh, muffy fluff muffin for breakfast, yeah. What a little fluffy muffin! Oh, uh, they have for the first time one raunchy sex. Just you know, the van is just uh, yeah. And she says after that, after she. <laughs> Sure glad I split mom and dad up in Christiania. This van's ready to rock and roll. Yeah. Oh, here comes Pasha. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right on time. <clears throat> uh, let's head out. I mean, first stop, München. Munich. Non-stop. Okay, Pasha. Yeah, oh, uh, oh yeah, yeah, uh-huh. Uh, so we're going to alternate driving. She can't drive. She doesn't know how to drive. And, um, okay, off they go. Bye-bye, Holland. I mean, it's so small. You know, I had a, I had a, it cost me 50 bucks in a passport photo. I could go anywhere in Holland I wanted to. Yeah, I was at the train station at 5 a.m. And I just bounced around Holland like two or three times a day. Oh, sunset, let's take a train to uh, Harlem by the sea. Pretty. Gogan Museum. Okay, let's head that way. Just stay in Holland where it's free. Uh, you're free. So uh, off they go. And, you know, within a few minutes, bye bye. <laughs> Holland, tiny little place. Uh, and uh, oh. Foxy and Silk.
Seem like they're going through the whole Kama Sutra in the back. Good thing there's a curtain between the two so he can keep his eyes on the road. So he's like stuck with like most of the driving and you got two hours to go. He's in Ulm, a historic uh, uh, town on the Rhine River. Famous for a guy dressed himself up like a bird, made some wooden wings and decided he was going to be the first person to fly. Jumped off the highest bridge into the Rhine. Yeah, drown. Oh, okay. Well, look. There's the Autobahn exit, Munchen. He takes it, and then uh, he's cruising. Marin Plaz, uh, you know, Diener Strass, and uh, then down uh, the wide boulevard, a maximum Melia Strass. Strass means straight. Why do they jam it in with the other part of the street? It makes everything so long. And then St. Anne Frosternas Istrus Strauss. Stop it, Strauss. Stop stressing me out. And then finally, <sighs> he drives into Ischlander Garden. Yeah. Easy to say, huh? Sanctuary for nude, oh, hippie sunbathers. Yeah. Oh, he shuts off the engine, coach to a stop there. And the early morning atmosphere, oh, mellow, yeah, oh. Well, he says, uh, uh, diplomatically, uh, to, to the lovebirds, uh, you can stop fucking now. We've arrived in Munchen. Ooh. Munchen, liberal, cosmopolitan city. They make their own acid. Uh, please don't bother anybody here. It's the most liberal city in Europe after Amsterdam. And after all, the Germans pioneered nude sunbathing. 1910, so the Germans have been nude here, you know. And then the hippies came and they just like swelled it up. It's like a migratory bird stop. You look down, there's a lot of green, and it's the oldest park in Europe. Huge. I mean, Golden Gate Park? No. Hyde Park? Central Park? We're talking Ischlander Garden. English Garden? Oh. Well, so, Pasha, what time is it? Foxy is like, uh, time for a, a wake up hashish hookah. Huh. Posh is really, yeah, uh, turned on by all the nude sunbeds. Takes a few photographs because uh, for his new book, The Hippie Hashish Highlights of Europe, smoke right here in the book. Munchen chapter. Oh, he's a photojournalist and he's just going to cover this whole scene well they all get out of the van smoke a, a travel hookah <sighs> and they're proud of themselves huh? hello non-stop damn square to Ischlander Garden oh they've explored Along the way, yeah. Seven Audubon rest areas. Hot water, cold water. Garbage can if you need it. And they rub their ass because, well, they have an empathetic feeling for the, there's various uh, uh, blends of concrete. You cross a, you cross a, a frontier and the concrete feels different under you. But it's, we need a summary of the whole trip up to now. Okay, Silk so steps up, looks. We could use a little more air in the front tires. Oh. Um. Pasha. Man. Oh, oh. I'm starving. I haven't eaten anything since we were back at the uh, 
that abandoned squat house for Foxy crashes. Uh, for free, huh? Squat here, squat there. Never care about having money. Yeah, that, that Dutch stew? Mm-hmm, hearty. Mm. But, uh... I got to do something about having no energy.